Hey guys, today we are going to discuss about cytogenetics. Before we further go into details, there are some basic definitions and some important points to be considered. Some of the general points are first, X chromosomes contains approximately 1200 genes. Y chromosome contains approximately 50 genes. Number 3, chromosomes are most easily visualized during the metaphase stage of mitosis when they are maximally condensed. Now, what is the difference between karyotype and karyogram? Let us have a look. Karyotype is the ordered display of 23 pairs of human chromosomes in typical somatic cell, whereas karyogram is the drawing of each type of chromosome and its presentation is haploid. Now, we will classify chromosomes on the basis of position of centromere. First is metacentric. As you can see here, centromere is in the middle. Second is submetacentric. Here, centromere is displaced towards one end. And third one is acrocentric. Here, centromere is far towards one end. Now, euploidy. Euploid means when a cell has a multiple of 23 chromosomes and it has two types, triploidy and tetraploidy. We will discuss about this in cytogenetics part 2. Now, we will discuss about aneuploidy. Aneuploidy is the gain or loss of chromosome. There are two, there are two types, monosomy and trisomy. And we will discuss about it in part 2. Disjunction means separation, so non-disjunction means non-separation. And it is the usual cause of aneuploidies. It is more likely to occur during oogenesis than during spermatogenesis.